So today we are making another classic Spanish dish that truly is one of the wonders from the Spanish kitchen. We're talking a tomato and egg scramble. This dish hails from the region of Murcia, which is located in southeastern Spain, where it's known as un revuelto de tomate murciano. It's basically made by making a very simple homemade tomato sauce, adding some eggs into the sauce, and then scrambling it all together. I know this sounds very simple, but let me tell you the flavors are mind-blowing delicious, folks. This recipe is so easy to make. It's made with very simple and affordable ingredients and it's all done in under 30 minutes. So we're going to begin by getting our ingredients ready. I'm going to finely grate between four to five tomatoes. We want to end up with a generous cup of grated tomato, which is about 230 grams. Now, if you prefer, you can skip this step and use the same amount of canned tomato sauce. For the next ingredient to prepare, I'm gonna grab half of a green bell pepper. As you know, I always like to cut around the bell pepper, that way there's no seeds involved. And we'll roughly dice the bell pepper. Moving on, I'm gonna finely dice half of an onion. And we'll grab three cloves of garlic and roughly mince them. And for the final ingredient to prepare, I'm gonna crack in six cage-free organic eggs into a bowl. Now to make this recipe, you can use whatever eggs you like, but you know the old saying, the higher the quality of the ingredients, the better the overall flavor of your dish. We'll season the eggs with some sea salt and freshly cracked black pepper. And we'll whisk the eggs together until they're well mixed. All right, let's start cooking up our dish. I'm gonna grab a large nonstick frying pan. Very important to use nonstick here. That way the eggs don't stick to the pan. I'm gonna heat this with a medium heat. And add in two tablespoons, which is 30 milliliters of extra virgin olive oil. Now the olive oil I'm using to make this recipe is from the Georgetown Olive Oil Company. This is an extra virgin Spanish olive oil made with the Pequal olive. It has so many beautiful flavors and it pairs perfectly with this dish. You'll find a link where you can get it in the description box below. After heating the olive oil for two minutes on a medium heat, I'm gonna add in the diced onion and the diced green bell pepper. And start mixing the vegetables around with that olive oil. I like to mix this continuously, that way the vegetables don't burn and they all evenly saute. After about five to six minutes and the onion is nice and translucent and the bell pepper lightly sauteed, you don't want to brown it. I'm going to add in the minced garlic and continue to mix this together. We're only going to go for about 30 seconds here. You don't want to overcook that garlic. You just want it to be nice and aromatic. Then we'll add in our generous cup of grated tomato, which once again is about 230 grams. Half a teaspoon of red wine vinegar, which is 2.5 milliliters. Half a teaspoon of white sugar, which equals two grams. This is to cut the acid from the tomatoes. And season everything with sea salt and freshly cracked black pepper. And we're gonna give this a quick mix that way all the ingredients are evenly mixed together and simmer it on a medium heat between six to eight minutes. This is enough time for all these flavors to come together and for that grated tomato to really thicken up. After simmering this for about seven minutes on a medium heat and you can see that that grated tomato has really thickened up, I'm gonna add in the whisked eggs And we'll start gently mixing all this together. That way we can create our scramble. We're gonna go between three to four minutes here on a medium heat. This is enough time for those eggs to be perfectly cooked. You don't wanna go any longer, otherwise the eggs are gonna overcook, which gives them a rubbery texture. After about four minutes, those eggs should be perfectly cooked. And as you can see, we've created a beautiful scramble. Once again, you don't want to overcook the eggs, otherwise they get a rubbery texture. I'm going to remove this from the heat. 
we'll transfer everything into a serving dish. And we'll sprinkle it with some freshly chopped parsley, folks. Check it out. Our Spanish tomato and egg scramble is done. Revuelto de tomate murciano. A beautiful dish from the region of Murcia. It's got incredible aromas coming out of it. Let's give it a try and see how it tastes. This is what Spanish food is all about. Here we go. So good. So simple, but so delicious. But first things first is the eggs. They are perfectly cooked. You don't want to overcook them. Otherwise they have a rubbery texture. Then you pair those eggs up with that homemade tomato sauce and it's an explosion of goodness. You saw this very easy to make, simple ingredients and comes together in under 30 minutes. You can serve this for dinner like they do here in Spain next to a salad or even for breakfast next to some roasted potatoes for an incredible meal. Really quick before I go, a shout out to a couple of my patrons, Jim Owens, Joan Kiliko, and Tommy Williams. Again, guys, thank you so much for being patrons of Spain on a Fork. You know how much I appreciate you. For the rest of you, if you're not with me on Patreon, consider becoming one. It helps with ingredients and equipment to continue making videos like this and sharing these Spanish recipes with you. You'll find my Patreon link in the description box below and iCard above. If you enjoyed today's video, hit that like button. Leave me a comment below and if you're not subscribed, you know what to do. Smash that subscribe button. Till the next time, hasta luego.